Hi, my name is Andrew Georgitis. I am the founder and CEO of Zuba Diving. Welcome to this introduction video to the, to the equipment configuration. And what I'm going to show you in this preview is two different configurations. One configuration supports what we call supervised diver. Another configuration supports our junior and open water certification as well as confined water certification program. As you may or may not know, the reason we have these two different configurations, they're not really different, they're just more options, is because in the supervised diver program for Zuba Diving, what's really great about it is that this is a way to introduce diving to, oil, to everybody, snorkelers, people who might be interested in seeing what's underwater, but without being intimidated by all the equipment. Remember, Zuba Diving is great because the heavy equipment, the tanks, are floating on the surface. And the divers below really free to move around. And it feels like snorkeling, but you can stay down at 20 feet or 6 meters. The reason we call it a supervised diving program is because you're always supervised by an instructor. So it's really great. This is an incredible program for resorts, for a, a Discover Scuba Diving program, for introducing new people to scuba without intimidating them. It's awesome because... They take a, we have materials, they go through the materials, so they take a little two hour class, one hour, two hour class, explaining the real only danger which is lung over expansion. That's it, really everything else is pretty benign, they're only at 20 feet 6 meters, they can't suffer decompression, they can't swim away and get lost, there's very, very little danger. So it's nice is they go through the materials and at that point they take a test, and the test and the, and the waiver and release, the instructor keeps. And they get a certificate, which means they don't have to do that portion again. Now they can travel anywhere in the world, and they can come to a resort like this. Right now we are INR. And you can look them up. A-I-Y-A-N-A-R.com. Great resort here in the Philippines. Absolutely beautiful resort. And you can come here and you can participate as supervised diver on Zuba, which basically means that you go out under the supervision of an instructor. And you can go anywhere in the world, it's great. So you can travel. The second configuration is the configuration in which you actually get certified. So you do online materials through Unified Team Diving. You then take a course with the UTD instructor, Unified Team Diving instructor and you become certified. Certified means you can actually do it without the supervision of the instructor. Well, that means you can travel with your Zuba unit. Look at this Zuba unit. It folds up into a one-by-one one cubic foot little bag. This is the whole unit, guys. It weighs five pounds. You travel to a resort, you show up, you, you, you rent a tank, and you can go Zuba diving. It's just incredible. So no longer do you have to totes around the world, big heavy scuba gear and all a ton of stuff. You just take the zuba bag and off you go. So the certification does require a little more because you will be independent, meaning there will be no instructor there in case something goes wrong. So I'm going to walk you through both configurations and then you can take a look at the differences. As always guys, I hope you really, really enjoy these configuration videos. Make sure to click on the dots on the picture so you understand the Zuba float, the long hose, the buoyancy compensating device, and all the different items that go into Zuba diving. What makes Zuba diving so unique, all right, is that it's not only just put a regular in your mouth and go swimming, it's that it integrates into scuba. It's the stepping stone to scuba. So you can Zuba dive in the morning and scuba dive in the afternoon with the same gear. It is scuba diving gear. And that's what's so exciting about this. Because I can go for a Zuba dive with my kids and then I can grab a cylinder in the afternoon and go scuba diving with the same gear. That's the big, the, the big advantage as we go through the configuration. But once you go ahead and click on one of them, either supervised or, or, uh, or, or certification, and, and, and take a look at the different configurations. Keep in mind, each one's a little step. They're all building blocks. So anything you own or buy, it will always be upgradable all the way. Other than that, as always, safe diving.